conversation ain't going in the scrapbook. You'll have no memory of ever talking to me. I won't forget this, because I am not under your spell this time. Whatever you say. But soon I'll be stronger than ever. And then you'll come back to me. After all, I still owe you a honeymoon. No. You're my bride. You think I'd let a little thing like death come between us? We'll have our child, and then everything will be as it was meant to be. No. No. You won't use me to hurt another person again. You are so beautiful. It's only a matter of time before we're together again. For eternity. Must have been some fire. Oh my gosh. Like, come on, guys. Let's go. Look, be careful where you walk. Oh. Stand dead when a sacred place gets destroyed. Even with the vampire roosting in the cellar? For any reason. Did you hear me? No. I didn't hear anything. Did you? Yeah. Uh, must have just in my imagination. Look, this place is really creeping me out. Yeah, it yeah. is. All right, but just relax, all right? Look, Rafe, check this place out. I'm starting to think that maybe coming here wasn't such a good idea. Hey, Rafe, you, you feel anything? Anything at all? Yeah, you know, because if you don't, like, we could just go or something. Rafe. that was is gone there's nothing here but a sadness a terrible sadness are you sure i mean are you a hundred percent sure just sadness an ache something very terrible happened here There's nothing. 
Not that I can feel anyway. Did not feel like you still feel. I can still feel it. I know I feel something, but I don't know what. I think what you're feeling is scale of... What? what? Particles of it. That's all. Resonating tiny fragments of what he once was fighting to come back Rick. together. Come on, man. Is that possible? Well, it's not likely. In fact, it can't happen at all unless... What? Unless what? All I'm saying is Caleb's particular brand of evil is... What? Just say it. What, what is it? Powerful and insidious. Rick, you said is like he's still alive. Yeah, and he's not in the... Odds are he'll probably stay that way, right? Well, if there's one thing I've learned about Caleb, it's never to take anything for granted, whatever the odds. So you knew him well? Well, well I knew him, all right. Did you have some stories? Yeah, you know what? Let's just not tell any stories, and I think maybe we should just go. That's a good idea. You're dead. You're not real. Oh, I'm real, all right. And I'm just gonna get more real every day. More and more undead. Courtesy of all those who try to destroy me. I'll just sit back and watch themselves destruct. No, they're stronger than you think. Really? So why is Eve beginning to wonder if she's a good mother? And how long will it take for Ian to doubt the Sandman's beautiful bride? No, that'll never happen. They love each other. As best they can, considering they're all like human. What do you mean? Human love is, is so pathetic and fragile. Like fine china, lovely to look at, but so very easy to break. How can you say that? How do you even know what it's really like to be in love? Think back on it. Did my touch not feel real? My breath on your neck? My body next to yours? No. No, what I feel for Jack is real. But that can change. No! It can. And it will. For all the loving couples who tried to destroy me. No, I don't believe you. It's already begun. They're starting to break apart as we speak. No. No, that's crazy. How can you say that? Just watch. This time, there's no one to stop me. You think you can make everybody fall out of love? Well, you're wrong. I won't invite you in again. I won't come back to the catacombs. I won't... Won't what? Dream about being in my arms? No. I, wa I, I won't let myself. I do admire your spirit, Mama. But you can't convince me that somewhere, deep down inside, you don't still feel it. That connection. What you and I share. No, I feel nothing for you. Goodbye. You can't leave, can you? Because you do remember how it felt when we were together. The way I would kiss you, touch you, make love to you all night, make you feel things that you had never felt. 
felt before. Then after, hold you close in my arms. No, stop. Our bodies are on the stop. I can't listen to this. I have to go. Not yet. Not until I see you. What are you talking about? What do you want from me? I want you to make love to me. I want you, Heather. I want you so much. No, I can't do this. Even if I could, it's impossible because I can't see you. Just open your mind, and you will. Open your mind, and make me strong. No, this is wrong. How can it be wrong? You're my wife. Something's a little out of sight. It's even sexier, don't you think? I can see you now. Well, you've always seen right through me, sweetness. Yeah, but why now? Late like this. When I couldn't see you at all before. Because my love for you is so intense. It's focusing all of my powers. Pulling everything together as it was. Desire is like a magnet. You're the reason I'm becoming real, Olivia. The reason you can see me. You're making me stronger. And when I'm strong enough, I'll have everything I want. This has to be a dream. Okay, I'm gonna wake up any minute. This can't be real. I, it can't be. It feels real enough. Doesn't it, sweetness? Yes. But... <laughs> I knew it, you're not. If I can't touch you, then... But you can feel me. You can feel my breath on you right now, can't you? I'm alive and inside every vein. In your mind, awake and asleep. In the depths of your heart. I'm there. Yes. When all is right, and in its place, we'll be together. But how? Tear by tear. As the lives of those who challenge me fall apart. And as their happiness dies and the power of their imperfect love fades. My power grows. My life grows. No, but love never fades. True love is forever. That's the lie, sweetheart. A fairy tale told to children. I've told you, human love is a fragile, brittle thing. Easy to break. This thing you have with Jack, it's nothing. No, that's not true. Only my love is forever. Human love has boundaries. My love can go on and on and on. Endless, like the night. And I'll prove it to you. Prove? You'll return to me willingly when I return. And then you'll know the meaning of everlasting love. When you'll reach out your cold hand to touch me. And I'll be there. And when that day comes, I'll hold you close. And make love to you. You'll make love to me. I vow it to you. Sweet Olivia, the next time we meet. You'll see more of me. But until then... Mm-hmm. <sighs>